Hi guys! In this video, I will show you the Rayhub beginner tutorial. So Rayhub is actually a rental property accounting software that can help you keep track of your income and expenses based on the property that you have added. So this is their website, which is rayhub.net. And once you have head over to their website, you should be able to see in here their homepage. So usually, owners actually use QuickBooks as well as spreadsheets. So in here, this is what it looks like. And if you actually use a spreadsheet, it actually makes things harder because of that, because it's not automated. And as you can see right here on Rayhub, they actually use automatic transaction importing, time-saving templates, rule-based transaction matching, portfolio and property dashboards, property-based accounting framework, as well as rental transaction templates and timely and personal customer support. So doing this is actually really impressive since Spreadsheet doesn't have it. As you can see right here on the disk comparison, the spreadsheet doesn't have the automated mortgage accounting as well as the visual financial boards, tax reports, onboarding support, receipt storage, investment return, and all of these things. Meanwhile, Rayhub, everything is been added or has been integrated on Rayhub, which makes things easier and simpler as well. Now, other thing to that, Business owners also use QuickBooks, which is actually an established software already. But Rehub is actually more independent and more depending on the actual app itself instead of QuickBooks. So doing this, Rehub is actually free configured for real estate already and not just other businesses as QuickBooks do. It has built-in schedule e-reports, investor focus, fixed asset schedules, and you can actually do some easy property reporting through this way and it's guaranteed you deduct every single dollar you deserve so this is actually a really good perk and here's another table of the comparison of those two they have both the income and expense tracking but they don't have everything from the property and unit level reporting up to the free and friendly onboarding support so that's one of the quick advantage of the rehab itself from those established things or established softwares. So yes, I admit that it's actually tiresome to do or use spreadsheets and QuickBooks when you're analyzing investment properties. That's why Rayhub is here to actually do everything for you. So Rayhub already connects your property as well as your bank account in order to track the cash flow of the properties that you have. So if you're interested to this application, you can go over to their website and click on to this Start My Free Trial now. So once you have done that, it will prompt you to the register option right here. So in here, just click on to this Get Started option and then choose which is the best that describes you. I'll choose Investor 1 and click on Next and then just choose in here the best one that describes you again and click on Next. For this one, just enter the number of units that you actually own or manage, and then just enter in here how long you own or manage those rentals. So for that, click on next again. Now, how do you currently keep track of your books? You can put in here the current. So for this one, I'll just choose spreadsheets and click on next. Now after that, input right here your portfolio name as well as your bookkeeping start date. So this is the first day you plan to record transaction in Rehub, and most people choose the start of the next tax year. So for this, click on the save and continue, and after you have done that, it will prompt you to add your properties. So I've already added a property earlier, but if you want to add another property, click on the this add option. And then enter in here which business describes this property, and click on next. Then input the property address in order to add it. Now, once you have added that property, click on the this finished option right here. And in your, as you can see, it will prompt you to link the accounts you use for your rentals. This will actually keep track of the transactions securely and automatically import them for your financial institution for easy and accurate categorization. For this one, click on the this link account option. And after you have done that, this will load in order to redirect you to another page. So you can see right here that Rehub uses Plot to connect your account and it can help you connect in seconds and keep your data safe so no worries on the security there. 
So for that, click on continue. And after that, you can enter your phone or you can also continue as guest. After you have done that, it will show you the list of institutions that you can choose. So you can see that there are all bank. So just choosing here which of your bank account you use to actually generate the cash flow of your rental properties. So it can be anything from this list right here. If you can't find it, you can click on the search option. So for this one, I'll head over and then use it here to chase. And then once you have chosen one, it will ask you to answer a captcha. So I'll just head over and answer that. Now in here, you can see this. So what you can do instead is you can just head over and then log into chase already. So for this one, click on the discontinue to log in. And after that, this will open in here this page wherein it will actually show you to the Chase Online, wherein you just need to log in or sign up for an account if you don't have it yet. But I actually advise you to already create an account prior to this if you are just starting out. So for this one, just head over and then log in your account through this page. Enter right here your username as well as your password and then click on Sign In. And then once you have done that, it will actually appear and it will direct you onto the Rehab dashboard where your accounts are already connected to the rental property that you have. Now, if you're having trouble connecting using the list of institutions that they have, like for example, if you don't have an account or a US bank, you can head over and head back to the link account option. And then choosing here the type of account that you want to create. It can be a bank account or credit card wherein you just need to add those in here manually. So head over and then choose in here which one. For example, choose in here bank account and click on next. Then input right here your account details as well as your last digits and account scope and the likes. After that, click on save. So I'll just head over and fill this up. Now just download your bank website's desired transaction for account. It can be an OFX, QBO, QFX. XLSX or CSV and then click on next right here and upload your transaction file in order to upload that particular transaction and have them reflected into your Ray Hub. After everything, just head over and click on this I'm done option and it will actually ask you for your loan. So just input the options right here and click on sounds good until you actually go over to this particular transaction hub of Ray Hub. So in here, you can see the actual rehab itself. So under your portfolio, you can see the cash flow of your dashboard. So it will reflect your properties that we have added earlier as well as the portfolio value of our property that we also added. Now, if the actual imported transaction list earlier has reflected some expenses and fixed assets, it will actually appear right here. Now you can see in here this one. So for example, if you want to add a transaction, just head over and click onto this option right here and input this. Now under that, you can see in here the accounts option. We have in here the banking and here's our manual account. And if you have a loan, it will appear right here as well as some property manager. Under the transaction, you will see all your revenues. So as you can see, we have in here the $600 revenue added based on the exported bank transaction that we have added so you can also see in here the book transactions if you have anything booked for this particular property that you have and we have in here the fixed assets leases vendors time tracking and the likes and it will also generate your report right here so for example let's see the net income by property report and let's click on this update filter option and you can see in here the report already created by rehab so apart from adding in your cash flow and inputting right here your portfolio and dashboard for that, it will reflect everything that you have added once you have connected your bank as well as your property from this. So it will serve as a one-in-one -one tool or an all-in-one tool that will merge all of the transactions created into your account and allow you to keep track of them in one application. So I hope you know now how insightful this Rehab application is. And if you're actually interested, they have a two months free option right here that you can choose from. So I hope you learned a lot on this video and I hope to see you on the next one.